Here we go again. <laughs> Time to go to Lenzerheide. There are three main routes from Val Sole to Lenzerheide. There's a long way around that's mostly highway driving. Pascal's going that way because he has to take the Fox truck. There's an intermediate route that's quite a bit faster, everyone else is taking. And then Jake and I have opted to take the long way, which is a curly, swirly mountain pass with a bunch of hairpins. Looking forward to it. Hopefully it's gonna be uh, an epic, scenic drive. Majestic, dude! What? <laughs> <laughs> I was so busy watching the cows on the left. I didn't even pay attention to the one on the road. <laughs> it's so dark in there. Do we have to? <laughs> uh, this is so scary. I can't even see the ceiling of this tunnel. Where are we? <laughs> <laughs> this is what happens when you route Google Maps and just say, that road has a lot of switchbacks, let's take that one. <laughs> oh man. We found it. Man, we roll up, we got accreditation already. The pit's already set up. Thanks, Jules. You're welcome. Um, so what's Lenzerhide known for? Yeah. As the name it says, it's known for a bike kingdom, Lenzerheit. No. Do they make Swiss cheese in Lenzerheit? You haven't seen all the signs around everywhere. No matter where you go, it's always bike kingdom, Lenzerheit. There's a pretty cool big step down at the end into the finish. The town is nice. The area is like gorgeous. The only downside is that we're down here and the finish line is like maybe a quarter mile that way. It can be pretty quiet, yeah. People don't usually have time to travel all the way along here to speak to Jordy and get help. So yeah, it's definitely quieter than normal. <laughs> and then you have to like do your puzzling or whatever and then pedal your downhill bike all the way back up. So with any luck, we'll get something happening like probably before and after practice, but I don't think during practice it's gonna be very busy. That's my initial assessment. Hmm. What else? There's nice cows here. <laughs> There's a nice lake. The lake in Lenzerheide is beautiful. Unfortunately, it looks like this week's going to be the worst weather of the whole summer. So the one venue where we have a lake to swim in, we're probably not going to want to swim because it's probably going to be cold and wet. But yeah, the lake's still beautiful. Thanks, Jules. You're welcome. I, I didn't really have much for you there. That was great. I was just waiting for you to say something about the lake, honestly. You ever been to Lenzerheide before? No, first time. What are your first impressions? It's a beautiful lake. <laughs> <laughs> now you can stop asking me questions. <laughs> All right, see ya. Have a good one, Pete. <laughs> This is my first time to Lenzerheide and I'm already so stoked on this location. It's absolutely beautiful and the pit setup's really cool. Um, we've got almost the whole team here, everyone except for Jordy. Unfortunately, Jordy's still stuck in Val Sol, waiting for a package and can't come here until he gets that. So otherwise, all of the teams are starting to get up and settled, the Fox pit's all set up and tomorrow we already have track walk day. So we'll see you then.